resources, unique creatures, and scenic landscapes fill Australia. Its coastal waters teem with colorful coral and vibrant fish. Australia also has snow-capped mountains, sunny communities, and ancient cultures. Australia is well known for its moderate climate, making the continent a vacation hotspot for tourists from across the globe. Australia is nicknamed the land down under because the entire land mass is located below the equator. As the driest inhabited continent on earth, much of Australia consists of deserts and dry grassland regions. This area is known as the outback. Few people live in the outback. Instead, most of Australia's population live along the southeastern coast of the country, which receives more rainfall than the outback. In addition to its rugged, I just lost my spot. In addition to its rugged outback, Australia is home to the Great Barrier Reef. This is one of the world's seven natural located in the state of Queensland is the world's largest coral reef. Many people enjoy diving to view the underwater scenery. The nearby island of Tasmania is separated from Australia by the 149 mile or 240 kilometer stretch of water called the Bass Strait. Tasmania also boasts beautiful landscapes, temperate climates, and relaxing beaches. Australia has produced some of the world's most famous faces. Academy Award winning actress Nicole Kidman, as well as Heath Ledger, Hugh Jackman, and Naomi Watts are just some of the Hollywood celebrities who began their careers down under. One of the world's greatest opera singers, Dame Joan Sutherland, is from Australia. Dennis ace Yvonne Gulagongali and Aboriginal poet, actress, and Australia's celebrated artists and athletes. Apologies for any mispronunciations, by the way. Kangaroo tail soup made from authentic marsupial meat and Vegemite sandwich spread. A thick brown salty yeast paste flavored with celery and onions are traditional Australian foods. Such delicacies and snacks can be sampled throughout the island continent in restaurants and supermarkets. I would say I wouldn't call Vegemite delicacy, but kangaroo tail soup delicacy. Vegemite sandwiches. Okay. I was about to say. Australia. Australia is 2,000 miles or 3,200 kilometers southeast of Asia and 7,000 miles or 1,100 kilometers southwest of North America. The Timor Sea, Arafura Sea, and the Torres Strait. On the south of the Bass Strait and Indian Ocean border Australia, the Southern Ocean also borders Australia on the west, while the Pacific Ocean creates the eastern border. Australia is divided into six states. These states are New South Wales, Queensland, South Australia, Tasmania, Victoria, and Western Australia. Australia also has two territories, Australian Capital Territory and Northern Territory. Many small islands such as Norfolk Island, Christmas Islands, and the territory of Cocos Islands are dependent areas of Australia. We have a sweet koala. There's a picture of Tasmania and Brisbane and a big old map of Australia. Location and resources.
Tasmania, South Coast. The Eastern Islands receive the most rainfall of Australia's three regions. The highest areas of Australia are located in this region, as well as low plains, sandy beaches, and rocky cliffs. The Eastern Islands are also known as the Great Dividing Range because the slopes divide the region's water flow. Australia's central lowlands is a flat region where inland riverbeds remain dry, except for rare periods of heavy rainfall. Grass and shrubs cover much of the area, while other parts are a sandy desert. Much of the western plateau also consists of flatland. Australia's four major deserts cover a large portion of this area. Grass and shrubs cover some areas. These regions of the western plateau are used for grazing land. They're also low mountain ranges. Two-thirds of Australia's area is located south of the tropics, producing warm summers and mild winters. The northern portion of the continent is located in the tropics. This area experiences warm or hot weather the entire year and has a wet and dry season. Australia is known for minimal rain, clear skies, and large amounts of sunshine. Plants and animals. On rare occasions, carpets of colorful wildflowers blanket Australia's deserts. Buried beneath the dry ground, thousands of wildflower species wait for a heavy rainfall before blossoming. Milkmaids, orchids, and honeypots light up Australia's southern regions. Acacias are some of Australia's most common plants. Nearly 1,000 acacia species live throughout Australia. These strong, brightly flowered shrubs live in nearly every region of the continent. Another common plant is the eucalyptus or gum tree. There are more than 700 eucalyptus species living throughout Australia, except regions. Australia's diverse landscape is home to unique wildlife, including quolls and great white sharks. Marsupials are the best known Australian animal species. Australia is home to about 150 marsupial species, including kangaroos, koalas, Tasmanian devils, and wombats. Monotremes, or egg-laying mammals, also live of monotremes, the platypus, and the echidna. Bats, rats, mice, and dingoes are other mammals native to Australia. Desert dragons and flightless birds also roam Australia's land. With about 700 bird species, including the emu, kookaburra, and lyrebird, Australia's bird population is soaring. More than 600 reptile species, including the saltwater crocodile and shingle-backed skink also live throughout the continent. Natural Resources Australia has many natural resources. About 65% of Australia is suitable for farming or ranching. 60% of this land is used for grazing. Ranching is an important industry. Some ranchers raise beef cattle for meat. As the world's largest wool exporter, Australia boasts many sheep farmers. Wheat, sugarcane, and grapes are some of the few crops that can survive Australia's arid climate. Australia's minerals include copper, gold, lead, and zinc. Australia is the world's leading bauxite producer. The continent also has large amounts of iron ore, nickel, and tungsten. Queensland, New South Wales, and South Australia produce more than 95% of the world's opals. Economy Tourism In Australia, people can scuba dive through schools of fish and giant clams in the Great Barrier Reef. Thrill-seekers can also venture on a four-wheel drive road trip through the outback. Visitors can take a trip thousands of years back in time, viewing rock art painted by early Aboriginal Australians. Australia is the perfect place to relax barefoot on the beach. Picturesque landscapes, festive celebrations, and a variety of 
Northwest Australian Symphony Orchestra. Some of the world's best known celebrities come from Australia. Although she was born in Hawaii, Nicole Kidman moved to her parents' hometown of Sydney when she was a toddler. Before making her Hollywood debut in 1989's Dead Calm, Kidman started many Australian film and television productions. At age 16, she landed her first movie role in the Australian holiday classic Bush Christmas. Actress Naomi Watts was born in Great Britain but was raised in Australia. Actor Heath Ledger comes from Perth, rest in peace. Hugh Jackman, best known for his role as Wolverine or Logan in the X-Men movies, is from Sydney. Australia is also home to many talented authors. In 1973, fiction writer Patrick White won the Nobel Prize for Literature. He was the first Australian to win this award. His best known books include The Tree of Man, Foss, and Writers in the Chariot. In 1964, poet Ugt Guru was the first Aboriginal Australian to publish a poetry book. It is titled a writer, actress, artist, and campaigner for Aboriginal rights. Sports With plenty of sunshine and warm days throughout the year, Australia is bustling with sports and recreation activities. From team sports to golf, Australia has a sport to suit every taste. Most large communities have professional and amateur sports teams. Cricket is one of Australia's most popular sports. The game is played on an oval field with two teams of 11 players. Players use a bat that is round on one side and flat on the other to hit a ball a little larger than a baseball. Games can take several days to play. The Australian national team competes against teams from around the world, including Great Britain, India, and the West Indies. Australian football, rugby league, and rugby union are three popular Australian sports. Each team has between 13 and 18 players depending on the sport. Teams try to score goals by pushing past the opposing team toward a goal on the other end of the playing field. In Australia, these sports involve a great deal of kicking and tackling. The players wear little or no padding to protect them from injury. The Australian of the sports are much faster than the American games since there are no huddles or timeouts. Netball is another popular Australian sport often played by women. Like basketball, netball is played on a court. Instead of baskets, there is a goal with a hoop on each side of the court. Players pass the ball up the court. Water sports such as swimming, surfing, rowing and diving, and scuba are also popular. Scuba sport, but oh well. Sprinter Kathy Freeman is an important Australian athlete. At the 
Australia. 